Hello and welcome everybody. Are you interested in resin printing or do you do that on a normal basis? Well, I'm doing the same and I've noticed some limitations when I'm using the Wash and Cure Anycubic machine for uh, washing and curing my prints. Now, one of the limitations was the fact that I need a period of eight minutes for curing my prints. Another one was the fact that always the machine starts predefined on the cure setting and sometimes I do click by mistake on start and I mess up my prints. Another big limitation for me was the fact that uh, the machine only notifies me audibly that the process has been finished no matter if that's wash or cure process. So I went ahead and I redesigned the board using the same connectors, so it will be a drop-in replacement, but this time a much more improved functionality can be achieved. Why? Because I'm using a ESP32 uh, processor on it and it can be coded under Arduino IDE, Platform I.O. or whatever suits your needs. Uh, I've used Arduino IDE for the code that I wrote for it and right now I have a beautiful web interface that I can use to set up the timing for whatever I want it to be for washing, for curing, but also for notification. You can grab the notification from a web browser which is connected to your home network or it can be its own access point and at the same time if you want you can implement into it MQTT uh, communication so it can send you messages once everything gets done. Let me show you how it works. So this is the new board which is using a 096 inch OLED screen. It has four buttons. The OLED screen is optional but it's useful to give some pieces of information. All the connectors are labeled with plus 12 volts, ultraviolet connection, motor connection, proximity sensor connection, and fan. And onto the back of it we have an ESP32 module. Um, all the interfaces that need to be switched are switched through MOSFETs and as a motor driver I've decided to go with an A4998 motor driver just because I think this is a good option for this machine. It's also compatible with a DRV9925 and here we can find the jumpers for micro stepping, which again can be customized. I just prefer to go with the maximum possible. And here we have a programming port for the ESP32, which is an RS232 port. And now let's get it installed and see how it works. So after we took out the four screws which are holding in the front panel, we can just pull that off slowly and we can expose the original board. Now the connectors are already labeled, at least in my case they are already labeled. So the fan is labeled with fan. We have an S for the proximity sensor over here, UV, motor and 12 plus. So that's going to be fairly easy. I do not need to remove the original board. So let's do this. When connecting to the new board, now I'm just going to have to follow the label on each. So I'm going to take motor and connect it to motor, UV to UV and 12 volts to 12 volts. Same on this side. Now everything is in place. I have designed some small props for it in Fusion 360. Of course, you can fully design a uh, front cover, but I just didn't want to do that and I didn't have the time for it. So this is going to work just fine for me. Now I'm going to change the camera angle and I'm going to power it on for you. So as it's powering on, it says power up. 
and it already connected to my local Wi-Fi network. It's informing me that it's a client to the network and it's giving me the IP. Now I can show you already that I can start the curing process from here. I can stop it and it says curing done. It's the same message that is given after the curing is finished. And if I press here, it's gonna show me again the information about the network. Now I'm gonna show you how it's gonna do the washing. So now I have placed the washing recipient inside and if I press the washing button, it's gonna start washing the parts that would be inside. Of course, I have no parts inside at the moment. If I try to remove the lid, then it's gonna stop because it's using the proximity detector. And once the lid is replaced, in order to start, I just have to press washing again and it will start washing. Now I'm gonna show you how it works connected to say a mobile phone yeah so i'm connected to the same wi-fi network all i have to do is to punch in the address so now i'm connected to the uh, web interface where i can see the status the status says it's ready which means it can do any operation i give it i can see here that the washing duration is set to eight minutes and that can be changed so it can go to easily to 15 minutes that's the maximum that i've set because i consider it's enough for myself so let's say i set it now for three minutes same thing can be done for curing so now it's at six minutes but this can grow to 15 minutes as well of course this can be changed in code and I can start the washing operation from here. And now it says on the status, wash active. And I can stop the operation. Or I can start the operation from the phone. And then I can stop it from the washing cure machine directly. The only thing that's not coming back is the switch. Oh, look, it came back as well. Same can be done for curing, but now I have the recipient inside, so I don't want to do that. So this is the concept that I came up with to fix my problem with the washing cure machine from any cubic. Now, in case you're interested to do something like this yourself, please check the links in the description below. The project is fully open sourced, so you can find all the information on GitHub, including the schematics, including the code that I've uh, wrote for this machine and also the libraries that have been provided as an open source for the community by their respective developers. I do not claim that the code wrote is good, but it works and that's all what matters for me. You're more than welcome to pull or to uh, help and contribute to build a better code for it. If you're interested in just buying directly the board, also, in the links in the description below, you're going to find where it can be bought from my Tindy store. Thank you very much.